this is the question of uh, 2016 october november paper 11 one, one, and uh, the question number is 13 so it's about uh, whether some collision is elastic or not so it says two spheres travel along the same line same line with velocities u1 and u2 so its velocity is u1 and its velocity is u2 they collide and after collision their velocities become u v1 and v2 respectively so u1 turns to v1 and uh, u2 turns to v2 now with this table we have to identify which collision is not elastic so uh, in elastic in uh, elastic collision so the criteria uh, for being elastic or not elastic is so we have a very uh, simple equation we have a relative relative velocity relative velocity of approach velocity of approach should be equal to relative velocity of separation relative velocity of separation of separation so that means the rate at which the two bodies get near before collision should be the rate at which they get far away from each other after collision and the expression should be for for the, them is for approach it is uh, u1 minus u2 and uh, for separation it will be it will be v2 minus v1 now we have to see if this thing applies in these equations applies or not and uh, in which this thing does not apply is the correct answer so let's first uh, do it here so if uh, we put it to for u1 and uh, minus 5 for u2 it will be u1 minus u2 will be equal to 2 minus minus 5 2 plus 5 that's 7 and if you do v2 minus v1 it will be minus 2 minus minus 5 so minus 2 plus 5 so this will be uh, it is a let's say for choice a it is a 2 minus minus 5 left side equal to 7 and for the right side is it is a minus 2 minus 2 minus v1 is again minus so minus 5 that's equal to minus 2 plus 5 equal to 3 so that means our answer is in choice 1 itself because these two quantities are not equal so v2 minus v1 is less so the collision is not elastic let's go for other choices as well so let's uh, go for choice number b so we'll have 3 minus minus 3 that's equal to 6 and here we'll have 6 minus minus zero that's equal to six equal so it is elastic so b is not the correct choice so for c it will be three minus minus two which is five and then it will be six minus one that's again equal to five 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 equal elastic so for d we'll have five minus two equal to three and then six minus three is equal to three again equal so a is the correct choice for this question